Hi guys, welcome to this computer system. It's the one that we use to create Carly. So we've created the Carly 12 and some of us are now interested in how to create something and have all kinds of questions. What you do is if you are on a computer, in a new system, right, your own system, then you don't have this folder Carly and this is all you need to learn about Carly. And I'm responding to a specific user, I always do that. But in the meantime, I make a video so everybody knows, not just this one person. So it's online. The thing about online, right? Go to a browser. Outlinksiso.com, that's where we are. You accept everything, Carly, here it all is. And here we have the downloads and so much more. Well, it will, I guess we need to load something up there. Anyway. Um, last build of Carly, Carly GitHubs. This is the essence, right? You go here and then we see, oh, look, we've shared everything and anything, right? The Carly 12 is the ISO. And here it says, get all Arclinux Carly Gits. So let's see if that's still correct. So the first thing you need to do is copy paste this link. Then let's go to the desktop by way of exercise. And we're gonna go and git clone that particular thing. So we got here Carly 12. And in here it says get all Arclinx Carly gets. Uh, let's see if I need to add something to the list. Probably need to update this thing. So you see that in order to learn from Carly, you need the references in, in the past. So we need to add Carly 12 to it and we need um, more things. So you do, you run this thing. Let's see where it puts it. That's also important. He's gonna git clone everything. Here is a variable. So if I run this, me, right? I would like to have it one level up. I would like to have it here. So control V. And after the video, I'll just, well, in the video, I'll just update the text and then upload it for you guys. So this is what you need, because you need to study how did the code change, and it's super easy, right? You just do a compare and then have a look. What did we change back then? There are always reasons why we do things, but why did we do things? Now, you can, of course, also start in the back end, right? Uh, no need to start here. This is the most recent change going from XFCE to cinnamon and somewhere in here is going from plasma to XFCE. So if you're thinking about installing Mate, well, the third desktop, right? It's just the same workflow. So here everything gets downloaded. Let's have a look at what we're missing. So we're missing Carly 12 in the list. So that's something I can add already. And all you need to do if this happens in the future is just add a line. <laughs> How easy is that, right? Control V. 12 is missing and there are other things missing as well. And voila, save, done. Other new things that I've created is this one, the Carly Sniper. That's new. Is, uh, well, Actually, let me show you something. I was thinking of making it alphabetically, but you don't have to think about that. You can have a little function in there in Sublime Text, which makes life easy, right? Like this. And then what else? Kali Karamar is, is the same. We, I mean, the name is the same. We've updated it. It's there already, All right? And all the rest is, is old school. So the thing is, um, I run it again, <laughs> right? Can we do that? Yes, we can do that. We can just run it again. So this one can go arrow up, run it again. Viper team comes in, Viper grub team comes in. Those are the new guys that came in. So now the question of the user, right? If you uh, want to learn something, if you want to find something, 
you have to use the tools and rip grab is something rg is something so the package is pseudo pacman well i have something called velo <laughs> and we're saying what in in dutch it's it's bicycle <laughs> right but if you type development right development this is how you need to remember it development i took out the words velo right development so if i type velo it's going to install sublime text an editor platinum searcher which is ag rib grab which is rg and melt to compare but everything is here of course because i have excel so what is my suggestion to the user he wants to know something about the desktop about calamaris so rg calamaris all references then rg dot desktop right references to the desktop file and sometimes you need to add a um, oh, bracket no it's not bracket <laughs> what is again quotes quotes yeah quotes and then you can search for something but this ag and rg and pt there's another pt as well so pt uh, xfce for instance for instance you get all the references in the files where xfc4 is mentioned right couldn't be any easier to figure out where is a certain word mentioned so that's inside the file when it's not inside the file but the name of the file i do catfish search with catfish and i look for like say a pacman.conf where is the references of the pacman.conf these are all the pacman.confs of course they're in every single carly release but also here and here and here and so you study up right even here you can say showed hidden files and search inside the file so from time to time if i don't i don't believe ag or rg or pt i i test it out with another tool to see hey is it working another tip is go don't stay at the top level here but if you're thinking about changing things in this case, Carly, Carly Calamaris, um, a Calamaris build. Mm -hmm. Where's the Calamaris build? So that's the configuration. We need to go to the package build of Calamaris. If you want to change something in here and see what did we do, right? Maybe you go down a level, few levels, and try again, defining it here on this particular level, and maybe then they find it. <laughs> KPM core. Voila. So we need to have KPM core to be able to build uh, column bars, right? So references all around. So this is how you find things. Yep. This is how you find things. Now the question in particular for him is one level up. Carly system installation, etc, scale desktop, here it is, Calamaris desktop. And inside Calamaris desktop, you'll find that control find icon, right? You need to give him a Calamaris icon. So Calamaris.png, Calamaris.svg, and the most of the users, they, well, developers, users, they put it in the user share icon. So when you make a package, you can suggest, right? Suggest, never put PNG behind it or SVG, just the name. You can suggest a icon and then put it in high color somewhere in here, right? You define your own icon, create your own icon and say, okay, I'm gonna put it in apps or I'm gonna put it in scalable and there in apps. And here are the guys, right? The developers have put their own icon in here but we don't want their icons. We're gonna take our own icons. But that's oh, that's something you decide eh? in the theme. What theme do I like to see? But this is their suggestion. So you can put your suggestion here as well. That's all about icons. And that's also about learning. I'll put the building here, the, the text to get all the GitHubs and do another check so you can start 
building your own distribution cult, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> All right, cheers.